You know, sometimes I don't know why I do the things that I do. <laughs> what I mean is that the original plan for this video was I was going to play Project Pokemon, Project Pokemon. We all know what happened to Project Pokemon. This is called Project Polaro. Oh my god. Project Polaro. And I would, if you if you want to play Project Pokemon in 2020, this is the one I recommend the most. Because not only is it just an exact replica of Project Pokemon, but it also has a bunch of new content that the original Project Pokemon did not have. Custom built areas. New Pokemon, you know, like we got all the Sword and Shield. There's a bunch of new legendaries, like... There, there's, there's, I think there's 10 gyms now, 11 gyms now, instead of 8, like, Project Polaro is very good, and each time it gets deleted, which it gets deleted quite often, it immediately comes back, and you save all of your progress, it is perfect, it is very good, I would very much recommend, um, I'm not going to explain my views on these types of copy-paste, uh, Project Pokemon games, uh, I already explained it in my Project Pokemon in 2020 video that I did a few months back. You can check out that video as well in the description below. I, Which, it has very quickly become my most popular video. And at a whopping 12,000 views, I've, I, I can't believe it. Thank you guys so much for the support on that video, which is why I am back with the Project Pokemon content. And like I said... I didn't say it because I accidentally didn't record the first time I said this stuff. <laughs> yeah, what I was getting to was that if this video can get 15 likes, then I will do this again. And basically what I'm doing is the original idea was I was going to just play random battles with people in this game for the for, for nostalgia's sake. Because Project Pokemon is a very nostalgic game these days because... If you don't know what happened, it's been deleted. But I decided to add a twist, a penalty, for each time I lose a battle. And I think I'm going to do about four battles in this video. Bam. White vinegar. I'm going to be taking a drink of this each time I lose a battle. And this may not look like a lot, but if I, lo if I lose every battle, then it's going to stack up. And... I really don't want to drink this stuff, so hopefully I don't suck too much in this video. <laughs> but yeah, 15 likes, and I will do this again. And also, if you're new here, consider subscribing, yada yada. You know the drill by now. Let's get into it. Alright guys, so I think that for my first battle, I'm going to be playing with my original party here, which I see, which you can see, that I've got a Alakazam, a Gengar, a Nidoking, a Swampert, a Pidgeot, and a Victory Bell. The Gengar and the Pidgeot are holding their Mega Stones. Swampert is holding a Leftovers, and let's just type in the chat if anybody wants to do a battle. How many times have, se have you seen this in chat in Project Pokemon? The nostalgia. It's... The nostalgia is flowing through my veins as we speak. Now let's just hope that somebody actually w wants to battle me because... Oh wait, there's a lot of champion levels. I think I might... I think I might fail. Ah! Here we go! The boss Christian 2009 is ready to fight. Alright. So he's got a Tangeroth, a Scizor... A Greninja, a Dragonite, a Lucario, and an Arcanine. Hmm, okay. So I'm just going to go into Nidoking. Let me get rid of the chat. Just to get that out of the way. Um, so the reason why I'm going into Nidoking first is I would like to set up a Toxic Spikes. So he's sending out his Scizor first. And... Okay, that did a decent amount of damage. Let me just get the the spikes set, and hmm, I'm wondering if I should switch to Pidgeot because Pidgeot's got Heat Wave, which is a Fire type move, super effective. You know what? All right, let me take the risk. Let's switch to Scizor. Oh, I mean, uh, <laughs> here, let me just actually keep keep the chat open, see what my opponent has to say. Mega. And heat wave. Let's see how this goes. Because I do also have the mega for Gengar, but I don't think Gengar will really help me out in this fight. Because with Pidgeot, I've got coverage for the Tangeroth, and wow, he is still faster. But 
Would you look at that? I knock out the scissor in the fr Oh, Jesus. I knock out the scissor in the first. Oh, God, it's Naruto. Um, hopefully I'm faster so I can get a roost going. Oh, okay. Am I going to be faster than a Mega Lucario? I know Mega Pidgeot is fast, but is it Mega Lucario fast? It is not, and Pidgeot is down. All right, so... I would set up a Calm Mind, but the problem with Alakazam is that he cannot take hits. He is terrible at taking hits. Alakazam's defense and special defense are not the best. So I'm just going to go with the Psychic. I can't remember if it's if I'm supposed to be doing Psychic, see if that's going to do the most damage. He returned Mega Lucario and sent out Greninja. Um, oh, wait. Ah. It's like he predicted that. But the Toxic Spikes are... Helping out. Mm. What should I go for? Focus Blast? I don't really... I think that... Oh, I forgot about Dark Pulse. I don't know anything about Greninja. Oh, oh boy. Alright, let me just try and send out Gengar. I would go for a Destiny Bond. Wow, I haven't... Oh, wait, no, I've knocked out one of his Pokemon. The Scizor. Um... I ju just go... Oh, wait, no, I was about to go for Confusion. That's a bad idea. Uh, go for Shadow Ball. And Grenade... Oh, God, Gengar is out. <sighs> Alright, I was about to type in chat, but... Alright, let me just go for Swampert. See what... Wait, why... Why did he want me to go into Swampert? That's why. That's why. Uh, it looks like the only thing that's going to be... Oh! Ha! <laughs> the poison took out the Greninja, but I'm still going to lose because there's no possible way that my King is going to be able to defeat the Tangrowth, Dragonite, Lucario, Mega Lucario at that, and Arcanine. Alright, I guess I'm drinking vinegar. That did not do a lot of damage. That did do a lot of... Alright. Uh, GG. That was not a very good first battle. All right, let's let's get the camera back on. Hey guys, move the move the mic back just a little bit. Uh, all right, boys, here we go. We got our vinegar. Get a good look at that. It may look like water, but you gotta believe me. I showed you the tub earlier, and also by my reaction. Ooh, that smells like a very strong pickle. Oh! <laughs> oh! Ooh! Ooh! That is not good. Wow, it, it's like, it's kind of like, oh god, it's gonna, if I have to do that three more times, it's gonna, my throat is gonna be burning! Alright, holy mackerel. Ugh, it's definitely, it de it's definitely not enjoyable, but I don't, 5% acidity. Oh. Anyone at all want a random battle? Come on, I got three more to do before I can have a completed video. Hey, all right, Tiny Troon wants to battle. Oh. Huh. Okay, I can see why he didn't want to do random. Uh, I don't want to drink. Oh, he's bulking up. He's ready to sweep. He is ready to sweep my entire team. At least I've got... The Toxic Spikes down from Nido King, and... Oh god, he's he really wants to sweep me. How much is Double Kick gonna do? That's, that was super effective. Alright. His bulk ups are already working. Alright, so... I'm gonna Sludge Wave because it's Stab, and it's a pretty powerful move. He is... I need to get rid of this thing. Ooh. Ooh, wait a second. Oh, of course it's got leftovers! I'm about to lose, and I haven't even started yet. Return. I'm done. Uh, I'm done. All right. Well, 
This fight isn't entirely fair. Do you see his other team? Uh, oh, no. No, I'm just gonna go into Swampert. I know I should really save Swampert for the Groudon, which is primal, by the way. Fantastic. But I gotta, but I, I'm gonna hammer arm. Frick. Please, land. What is wrong with you? What is happening right now? Uh, 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 I'm already feeling not great from that first shot of vinegar. All right, I'm just gonna Mega Evolve and Hurricane. I wish I could get some water because my throat is a bit dry now. Which is fine, you know what? F hmm. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. All right, let me try. Let me try and get a. All right, I guess that's not happening. Gengar, please just, just kill, just kill his entire team. Just don't make me do this. It's over. Oh no! Bullcrap. This is bullcrap. This is donkey. Ugh, I'm gonna be so sick by the end of this. But you know what? Fine. 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 Fair and... Oh! Whoa! What to... What to do? I'm... I'm gonna go out into Ekans. Ooh, I've got Primal Groudon on my team. Here, wait. Um... Camera on. Camera on. I'm in the middle of a battle, but let me just get the vinegar, because this is such a... Am I going to lose again? Am I actually going to lose again? I'm going to lose the... Here, wait, just... Oh, God, I don't want to... I don't want to... Ah! Ah! This is so bad. I defeated... His first Pokemon. Jesus. Uh, Galarian Slowbro. Uh, I don't. Gunk Shot again? Oh, God. This is disgusting. Okay, that was a decent amount of damage for being not very effective. Wait, I survived that? I'm an Ekans. This is still a Slowbro. It's a level 78 Slowbro. Bro. This stuff is- what? I mean, now I'm dead, but... I think I might finally beat this. I'm saving Primal Groudon for last. Alright, so... It's a... Uh, let me check my moveset and all of my Pokemon. Oh, Probo Pass! We got Squidward! Um, let's set up an Iron Defense. Just try and turn this slow bro, I mean this probo pass, into a monster. An undefeatable, like maybe I won't even need to grout on. Alright. So, the slow bro is low, so I'm just gonna go for a regular discharge. How did it know? How did it know? Does it have something that I'm weak to? I don't even know what this thing is. Runerigus? It has levitate. Of course it does. Alright, so I'm gonna assume that it is weak to water, and I'm just going to assume, again, that my Stormy has a water type move. Alright, that was a good play. Uh, Runerigus lost some HP from what? I don't know. Scald! That's a pretty good water move. Even if it doesn't kill, it has a chance of a burn. Let's see if I can get the luck. Oregon. Come on, don't switch out. It's gonna switch out into something. Even if you switch out into the slow bro, which it won't be very effective. Actually, wait, it's part electric now, right? Ooh, Runerigus down! Oh my god, I think, I think I might actually win this one, cause. But I still have another fight after this, and I don't want... I don't want to drink vinegar again. But I think I got this fight in the bag. 
Is there anything else that I would need Starmie for? Not entirely, so I'm just gonna go for another Psychic and see how that goes. Alright, my Starmie is down, but that is fine. That is fine. Alright, let's see. What do we got on Palkia? Alright. What do we got on Primal Groudon? We do got a Fire-type move, as usual. Ooh, and then we got Fire... Alright, so let me just switch to Groudon. I know that this is a bit much for a Tartwig, but... Let's just go with the solid Fire Blast and obliterate! Primal Groudon's a pretty low level, but it's a Primal Groudon. Do you think I'm afraid of anything that this guy's got going? Ugh. Come on. Come on. I got four Pokemon left. You do too, but look. Look at the Pokemon I got compared to the Pokemon you got. I think I've got this. You do have a legend, and that is Tapu Lili. But Tapu Lili is not, is not the best. It's decent, but is it enough to stop a Primal Groudon or even a Palkia? Also, I'm sorry if I'm not as energetic compared to when I what I was at at the start of this video, but the vinegar is already starting to give me a stomach a little bit of a stomach ache, and I've only done two. I I don't think there's anything else that I would need. Fire Blast for, so I'm just gonna use one to finish off the Swine Up, and Swine Up is down. He's got two Pokemon left, and that is the Slowbro, which is at low health, and then a Tapu Lili. Oh, it's Tapu Fini. What the heck is Tapu Fini? It looks kind of like it would be a a Ghost type. I mean, I'm I'm just gonna go with the Stab Fire Blast and see how much that does. Oh, oh, it doesn't affect, and it missed. My last fire blast missed. Oh god, just go just go for just go for Iron Head. Come on. Do a lot of damage. Okay, Moon Blast, that didn't do a whole lot of damage. Uh, that also didn't do a whole lot of damage. Um Alright, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep oh wait, did I just unplug my mic? No I didn't, okay. I'm just gonna keep using Groudon until he maybe dies because I still if I just if I just knock off the top of Fini then I'm good because I've still got Probo Pass for the Slowbro and pretty much anything will take down the Slowbro and oh my god just don't miss is it capable of missing it didn't Tapu Fini's down and I think the battle is donezo sent out Galarian Slowbro um I think that, I mean, it's a slow, bro. It's, it's probably really slow, you know what I mean? And, oh my goodness. Yes! The winner! No vinegar for me. That match. Woo! G. G. Alright. So, we got our last battle for this video. It is another random battle, and as you can see, this guy has got a Misdrevious, a Metatite, a... What even is that? An Umbreon, a Sobble, and a Snorlax. And on my side, I got some got some decent Pokemon. Uh, I'm just going to go into the... What is it called again? Jinx. I'm going to be going into the Jinx. I'm going to be saving Tapu Koko for last, maybe. I mean, what is it that they can do that Tapu Koko can't? Um, ooh, maybe I should set up for a... Set up a Calm Mind. See if I can maybe sweep. <laughs> that would be funny if I if I if I swept this guy. I'm okay. I guess not. I was about to say if I swept this guy with a jinx, I would laugh. But I guess it, jinx kind of suck. Uh, on Weavile, we got Swords Dance, Ice Beam, Brick Break, and Night Slash. That is a decent move set. Uh, do we got any a, any stat moves or whatever this thing is? Acid. Uh, with a harsh, ooh, may lower their spirit. Does, does Tapu Koko got? Okay. Let's go into Weavile. Set up a Swords Dance. See if this does anything, because maybe, maybe I'll be able to sweep with Weavile. Or maybe I'm getting too confident, because I know that... Okay, that did a lot of damage. I know that uh, Snorlax is a beefcake. Oh, Weavile has got leftovers too? Literally the perfect Pokemon. What? Oh, of course it was a crit. 
Oh god, maybe I'm a little bit too confident. I'm just gonna send in all of the Pokemon. What in the world? This Skitty's got an expert belt. I'm just gonna go into I'm just gonna go into my all of my Pokemon, and hopefully I'll at least be able to take down one of them before Tapu Koko. Let's try a double edge with Skitty. See how much this this could do. Oh no! Oh no! Am I gonna have to drink vinegar again? The one I'm scared of is probably Snorlax and Umbreon, because those, those are the only Pokemon that are, like, half decent. So... Ooh, that did a... That did a decent amount of damage. Alright, let's just go with Toxic again. Or Acid, I mean. Um... Ugh. Okay, this isn't going as well as I'd hoped, but the other Pokemon that I have that aren't Tapu Koko are just not that good, so... Why did you get so much HP back? I thought that like the amount of HP that you that you take from the and from the opponent is how much is how much um what am I what is the word is how much you recover? But that was way more than because I had like nine HP. Oh, there we go. Lampan takes down the Metatite. Hopefully, you will at least be able to take out one more of these Pokemon. I mean, most of his Pokemon are, are pretty weak, like Mistrevious. The fish thing, Sobble, Barascuta. I do not know what that is. Here, wait. Which of Lampen's attack stats is higher? Whoa, his special attack is insane. All right, let's go for a Shadow Ball then. Oh, that's gonna. Oh no. All right, just, just do a lot of damage, Lampen. All right, that. That was good. That was good enough. Ooh, Tapu Koko with leftovers. The big boss is here. Let's go. Let's 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 hit an agility. Am I already faster? I mean, I'm a legendary, so maybe. Sharply rose. If I can get just oh. Maybe that was a mistake. It's literally a fish. Oh god. Oh no. I know I'm faster, so the bear the bear scuta is down. Oh! 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 Come on, RNG. Get hit by the para the parallelis. Whatever you however you say that word, I don't care. Get paralyzed, fully paralyzed, every turn. I might be able to pull this back, but I think that the Umbreon will be able to take me out. Because Umbreon is a good Pokemon, but... Nope. There we go. It was a crit, too. Oh, yeah, just... Just dump the... You know, dump the vinegar on the wound. Welp. Alright. GG. Three out of the four games lost. Alright, guys. Here we go. The last shot of vinegar to end off the video. I do not think this is healthy. Such a strong smell, I hate it! Alright, here we go, guys. The last shot of vinegar. Cheers to you all! 15 likes and I'll do this again with a different penalty. Oh god. I'm gonna throw up. Ooh. Ooh! I am tearing up. That did not go down right. That was the worst so far. Holy monkeys. Oh, holy mackerel. If I do this again, 15 likes, remember, and I'll do this again. I am not doing vinegar. Oh, my lord. Alright, guys, so... That was a lot of fun. Um, it was a it was a lot of fun going back and doing some Project Pokemon Battle videos. Uh, videos. Doesn't matter if that didn't make sense. I can't think straight now because the vinegar, it's burning my insides as we speak. But I really did enjoy making this video, and if you enjoyed it, 15 likes, and we'll do a part two with a different penalty. But that's gonna end. This video, if you did enjoy it, leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.
Bye, everyone. <laughs> <laughs>